Dana, thank you. Now, these views of the crowd in the Deer District last night, they were stunning, awesome, and yet startling for some. Milwaukee police estimated there were over 100,000 people in the Deer District, and doctors remind us we are still in a pandemic. They say a surge in COVID cases statewide is not a matter of if, but when, made worse by that huge gathering. And here's our Christina Laurie. It's not the buck, but the elephant in the room. To Middleton. Middleton puts up the jumper. Puts it in! The potentially deadly outcome local doctors expect will come from a week of celebrations. We're still in a pandemic and the CDC continues to advise against large gatherings, defined as events that bring together many people from multiple households. The upwards of 60,000 fans that flooded the Deer District to celebrate the Bucks' first championship in 50 years certainly fits that bill, as does the thousands more that packed local bars. That has infectious disease specialists worried and issuing a warning. Be a little bit mindful of the situation, um, not to completely let down their guard, and then also be respectful of others and their choices if they choose to mask or kind of stay on the sidelines. In Wisconsin, the number of COVID cases has been climbing every day for two weeks now, and 80% of those cases are the highly contagious Delta variant. Delta is not only more contagious, it has slightly different symptoms and can appear more quickly. So if you were we're out celebrating last night. We'll explain what you should watch for ahead at six. For News 3 Now, I'm Christina Laurie.